bum 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 pregame show oh <clears throat> good evening rivers welcome to another edition of rivet city's rivet flash i'm your host tritus and tonight we're gonna get into a few very interesting pieces of information it appears that dropbox has been hacked you know dropbox that favorite online storage utility you all know and love it looks like in 2012 Dropbox was hacked. They knew that there had been a breach but did not know that any information had actually been taken as far as credentials goes until now. So they are aware that credentials were stolen at that time and have notified all the people that have been affected. However, out of caution, if you have not changed your password since 2012 in Dropbox, you should go ahead and do that. Might as well go ahead and do that anyway regardless. Better to be safe and sorry. You should also be looking at changing your passwords at regular intervals on all of your different online logins. This also even includes your home computer. You don't have to do it every day, obviously, but good, good three to six month increments is pretty healthy. So make sure that you're setting, resetting those. Make sure it's not something like password or one, two, three, four, or something that's very easy to guess. Make sure it's a combination of letters, numbers, and special characters. With that being said, Let's move on to the next subject. An alien signal was detected earlier this week by Russian astronomers. SETI was set to investigate, and as it turns out, it may have been terrestrial interference after all. So it looks like this radio signal was coming from our fair planet, bounced off of something, and then came back, was detected by us. So no Vulcans out there this week, but SETI continues the search. Speaking of space, this week SpaceX unfortunately had a bit of an accident with its Falcon 9 rocket. There was an explosion on its launching pad and the entire rocket exploded, taking along with it the satellite that was meant for Facebook's new venture to get internet out to rural areas using this satellite. Fortunately, there were no injuries incurred during the explosion. However, this may set back SpaceX's timelines for some of their other projects. But knowing SpaceX and Elon Musk, they'll be able to bounce back, knock this issue out, fix the problem, and get right back on schedule. So, sometimes you guys get bumps on the roads. This is space. Uh, the final frontier. Things are going to happen. But luckily, nobody was hurt. And they'll be able to move right along and keep doing the amazing things they are all doing out there so with that that is today's rivet flash if you enjoyed this please subscribe to our youtube channel that is youtube.com search rivet city limited that's where you may have found this video otherwise check us out rivetcitylimited.com where you'll find all sorts of blog articles pertaining to this subject and much more like it check out the show notes we'll have links to all of these things that we talked about today in those show notes and also other articles and other discoveries we made this week with that also check us out on social media twitter.com whack rivet city ltd or at rivet city ltd and facebook.com whack rivet city limited we are streaming monday through friday you can find us on rivet city limited.com you can find a streaming schedule there on twitch we stream all sorts of games from battleborn to no man's sky so check us out there otherwise we will see you next week this is tritus signing off post game show post game show oh you're still here <laughs>